Hello everybody, Chromanson50 here, and by special request, um, I should probably explain this video. Oops. No. Hate it when I spit on my screen. But, um, yeah, a couple, no, not just a couple, a long time ago, I promised someone I would do a video on Terraria, and that video never came. So, just today, I was, uh, talking with him, and, yeah, brought it up. So, yeah, I'm finally here to do this video. So, to the one person watching this that will actually get it, yeah, sorry about the wait. So, I'm just gonna start a new thing. Hair shall be... I would say... Let's see... Um... It's perfect! Let's see, uh, blonde. How do you find a good blonde hair color? It's not... Oh, there we go. Perfect. Silvery. Okay, the eyes. Oh, crikey. I don't know his eye color. Oh, the hair color... Could be a little bit lighter. Much better, okay. Um, I don't know his eye color, so I'm just gonna assume it's blue. I really hope it's blue, or this is gonna be pretty embarrassing tomorrow. No, are they green? I'm pretty sure they're blue. Uh, skin. Definitely not that. Let's see... That's about good. The clothes. Shirt. Well, it's obviously black. Undershirt. Yellow. Like, really, like, really yellow. Pants, I'd say. Usually blue like this. Style, okay. Um, no, he's not a drug dealer. It's not what he looks like. Um, kinda. No, definitely. Oh, dang it. Um, what the, let's do black. Perfect! There we go. Soft core. Not sure what he plays on, but yeah. Create. There we go. It's perfect! Okay then, so let's check what time, how long that took me. About three minutes, I'm fine. Let's clean that off real quickly, and okay, here we go. It is a medium world, um, normal, it will be world three. There we go. What, you know, I, okay, ooh, we're the crimson. Okay, I've never played with Crimson before, but eh, I guess it'll be a learning experience then. So let's see, I should have probably called it the Land of Hamsters. And what else? The Land of Hamsters and Corn and Whiskey. In fact, I should just called it Whiskey Land. There we go. In our thoughts, it will always just be called Whiskey Land. Adding more grass. I love it when that happens. One thing to note about this game, um... Making worlds takes a little while. I haven't played too much, but I do know it does take a little while to create the worlds if you go for a medium. I usually actually play on small worlds, so this might be a little bit jarring for me. But it can't be that bad. I'm going to get a guide in some time. Because I am very bad at this game. I'm much better at Starbound. Which I will be doing an LP of when this stinking 1.0 update comes out. So, some people have that to look forward to. And the same person is looking forward to that Spore LP. Probably. I mention every single LP I'm going to do a gajillion and one times in my videos because I'm terrible at speaking. For some reason. There we go. It's Crimson. Let's go. And here I am. Um... They say there's a person who'll tell you how to survive in this land. Oh wait, looks me. 
You can use your pickaxe to dig some dirt and your axe to tap to cheese. Just place a cursor over the tile and click. If you want to survive, you'll need to create weapons and shelter. Start by chopping down trees and gathering wood. Okay then, guide. I don't want to listen to your voice anymore, so let's continue. Scope out the area. Wow, you walk really slowly in water. Bunner! Oh gosh, this movement speed! It seems like you move so slowly after... To, like not having the the Pegasus boots and stuff, or it's not even what they're called. They're called the Hermes boots. Stinking oak, or link to the past. That's what it is. I'm going to get a lot of stuff mixed up. I'm not used to doing an LP of this game. That's for sure. So let's see. It doesn't look like there's anything too interesting around our spawn, except for this weird tree. I'm gonna try and find a chest because usually you can you can find some good stuff in there. Um, ooh, a slime. Slime! Oh, oh dear. Green slime. Green slime. Oh dear. Whoa, that jump! Ow. Oh, I'm gonna die so many times. As I said, I am horrible at this game. Okay. I didn't die, I lost like a third of my health, but I'm still alive. Oh, there's another one. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh dear. Yeah, as said, I am very, very bad at this. Especially with using short swords, because I never use those. Okay, there's a cavern down here. Well then, I guess I'll chop down some trees over here. Oh, I see you. I see you, buddy. Yeah. Oh gosh, he has a lot of health. What is wrong with my aim? I can't even aim in a 2D side scroller. Oh dear. I'm not used to playing this game. I'm also not used to not being able to crouch. My horrible complaining aside, let's continue playing. I know some of the basics. Because I played this with uh, my friends once. This little area here looks pretty good for a shelter. So I think this is where I'm going to set up shop. Just clear out a couple trees and everything will be good. Oh, I see you. I see you there, blue slime. Don't even try to hide it underneath that horribly large mini-map. Yeah. Oh, man, these things can jump. Oh. How come they get to do the cool jumps, like, straight over you and stuff? It's so... So unfair, I want to be able to do that. Okay, take him out. Take out the slime. Nope. You're not jumping behind me, bud. Oh, not chill. You're not the master of jumping. Okay, then. Chopping down trees. You know, what I really like about this game is you actually start with tools. One thing that always bothered me about Minecraft was the fact that you literally punch a tree. And I've never done it before, but that just seems like a really bad idea for a multitude of... It is Pinky. The, the slime! Seriously? Oh gosh, it's immune! I can't believe it. it's immune to sword strikes. I, we're doomed, people. How are you supposed to defeat something that's immune to sword strikes? But I, I want to defeat it. Arr, get back here. Oh. Ah, I got you trapped, bud. Yeah. Yeah, I have quickly... This situation is not looking good for me. Come on, take him out, take him out. Oh, come on! Well, I'm going to call this episode the Great Slime Chase. Because that's literally what it is. The one time I see this stupidly rare slime... Not only do I only have terrible weaponry, but it just mercs me. No, I'm out. I'm out. No achievement is worth this. Stop following me. Haven't you caused me enough misery, you stupid slime? Hmm. 
Leave me alone, slimes! I have, like, half health. Because the slimes... The land of Terraria is a major slime problem. Go away! Can't even crap! Because every time I try, you're just there. I didn't want to make the Greaves! I am at 20 health. This this is going way worse than I ever thought it would. Okay. Wooden sword. Oh, come on. It's sl it had to be sluggish. And I had to not... I am at 20 health. Oh, dear. Ouch. Slowly but surely. I have 16 life left. That's a bad idea. To fight a bunch of monsters while you have this much health left. Oh, come on! They just keep coming! When will this horrible train of monsters just come to an end? Just stop! It's unfair, game. Just die! It's pink slime. If it kills me now, I'm gonna be so mad. Come on. Yes! Wow, that gave me a, a lot of money, actually. Now, let's run over here. And stuff. Oh, well. So, now we can actually get to doing things. I'm immediately covering up my character with armor. Because I'm going to die a whole lot in this game. Like, a whole lot. Let's just... Oh, that's not the... There we go. Much better. Deadly. 12 speed and damage. Much, much better. Got my sword. Got some bombs. Yeah. So now we can actually do stuff without dying every five seconds. Let's continue. I'm gonna build a house here because it's getting kind of late in the day, I think. I can't really tell in this game, but... We spent a pretty decent amount of time doing pretty much nothing. So let's actually get on with playing the game. Also, the shadows are getting slightly bigger. Might be an indication. Cut down the remaining trees. There's some other ones over there, but hopefully I'm not going to need them. I am very slow. I do not like that. Let's see. Wood walls, wood platforms. Well then, I guess this is gonna be- Oh no! Oh no, this- that's a terrible one. Okay, there we go. You know, I've always wondered, why on earth is wood better than metal? I'm not the most knowledgeable on copper, but any metal at all seems like it would be better than, you know, wood. But I guess that's just terraria logic for you. Cover the backdrop. So that this is considered a house. Not that I want the guide to move in. Because that just, no. I hate, I hate, I hate the guide. He's not really that helpful unless you're seriously looking for crafting recipes. But that is literally it. Craft the doors. And hey, some wood platforms too. Let's see. Yep, it's an axe. Nope. Why do you need a pickaxe to mine wood again? That just... Seems pretty contradictory. What is this? Lead ore. Hmm, okay. Oh dear. They're gonna invade my house, aren't they? Out! My house! My house, slimes! No! 
If the commentary in this video seems kind of odd, it's because this video is meant for someone. And they might be the only one to get some of the things I'm saying. Which is why I'm going to now bombard everyone with just references and stuff. Oops, forgot. Wooden door. There we go. Shelter. Pretty garbage shelter, but, you know, pretty much anything is good at this point, especially since we have an army of slimes outside of our door. Might as well get some money and some gel. Like the place up. Why are there so many slimes? First it was green ones, then blue, and then the pink slime, and now purple ones. This this difficulty curve, man, it's just too much. Eh. I need to make an attic, so I'm just gonna... Oh, no. Slimes, they just never stop. I seriously need to establish some form of safe zone. At least my weapon is so good it can take them out really quickly. Lucky with that deadly prefix. Pretty sure they're prefixes. Not sure what the official name for them is in the game, but I just call them prefixes, because that's what they are, kind of. Although they're not the little ones that come before words. Oh well. Now, I have one goal and one goal alone. Get the DSMG. That's an odd goal, but that is my single goal. Just get the DSMG, and that's it. It's not going to be the end of the series, maybe, but... Yeah, my primary goal is just get the DSMG. Not sure how you get it. I'll look it up, but... Oh dear, it's getting dark. Before the zombies and stuff show up, I'm getting out of here. Take out the blue slime. Oh, that juke, though. Let's get the heck out of here. Craft a couple torches. Oh, I hear them. Hurry the heck up. Hurry the heck up. Come on. Close the door! I, I see you. I see you, zombies. Stop breaking at my door! Ah, my weapon is very bad. Hey, you! Stop breaking out my door! It's my door, not yours. Take you down, grab the money. Oh gosh, close the door. Just close it. Are you seriously gonna continue? It's like they're trying to lay siege to me or something. Out? No. Bad floating eyeball. Ah, now he's in my house. Oh, well. Fight off more zombies. Oh, so many zombies. It's like the modern sandbox industry. It's the modern gaming industry. Oh, no. This one has a helmet or something. Oh, this is not good. Oh, are you serious? Okay, maybe I shouldn't call this uh, episode So Many Slimes. It should just be The Siege, because that's what this is. I'm literally just being besieged by a gajillion and one zombies and floating eyeball things. Cthulhu eyes. Not the eye of Cthulhu, but Cthulhu demon eyes. Not oh. uh, demon eyes. Come on, take them out. There we go. I seriously need to establish some defenses. Because the current nothingness just isn't cutting it. And there's more! I'm gonna be so rich by the time this is over. Casually. Oh, there we go. Health. Oh, come on. Just, I'm just closing the door. I give up. I'm gonna craft. <sighs> this is not how I envisioned the first episode of an LP would go. Ok, 
Okay? It just sounds like there's so many of them. I got it. It's perfect! I can jump over it. They can jump over it. So that's useless. There we go. Oh, come on! They can seriously jump over that? I need myself some rocket boots so I can have a 20 million block tall wall. And this, that, why is this one zombie so tough? Now hurry the heck up, place another block, and keep my house safe from zombies. Gosh darn it, hate those zombies on my lawn! These zombies, why can they jump so high? They don't even really have legs. Well, they do have legs, but they're probably really rotten away. Their muscles are too. Okay. Aside from the horrible eyeball monster things, I'm safe. And I'm nearly dead as well. Can I make some sort of healing thing? No? Okay. Pink gel. Not sure what I'm supposed to do with that. Oh, pink torch. Okay. Shackle. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Just gonna wait for my health to regenerate. This is gonna be a really long first episode. Oh well. 27, 29. That's about all I can do right now. Except for, well, I could go outside, but that means, oh well. I'll fight the eyeball thing. Because I really need an attic or something. To store stuff. Okay. Make a lovely little attic in here. Oops. Seems legit. Oh wait, I'm getting a... Shift tab does not do anything. Dang it. I'm probably gonna have to check that out, so... I'll do a little bit more. What am I at? 23, okay. I'll check that. Soon. Not right now, though. Okay, um, use those wooden platforms from before. There we go. And now some wood walls. Like, a lot of wood walls. Like, a lot, a lot of wood walls. Okay. There we go. And there we go. Got myself a nice little... Why are there two different woods? There we go. Still got 52 to spare. And I have an attic. So at any point, I can just jump up. And there we go. I have a place to store stuff. I got two walls. I got two Donald Trump approved walls here. Now, I can't get over them currently. Oh, wait. Yeah, I can. So I'll put, I'll put some stuff there so that I can get over the wall myself. 
However, I'm going to need a better way of getting over them real quick. Uh, it looks like they're retreating. Well, that's good. Except for that guy, apparently. Put some platforms there. Yeah, they still can't get over. The plan is put... Oh, you know what I could do? If I put doors on top of the wall... I can put a door up here. Oops. I cannot place a door here. Okay, this plan is definitely going to work. BAM! It's perfect. Kind of. Not really, but it's, it's a temporary solution. Okay, now that I have my perimeter defenses, uh, let's see, I'm going to need some more wooden platforms for these. Just two more. Now, I'm, what I'm going to do is bloody dangerous, but there we go. Kind of odd, but it'll do. I'll definitely expand later. But yeah, that was my very first night in this playthrough. Okay then. Well, this has been Chromanson50 with a long-awaited video by for a very certain person. So yeah, sorry to you that I took so long to get this out, but I finally did it. Well, this was Chromanson50 